Okay, this one isn't an A4, but it's close enough, so we're not going to... I don't think we're going to be enlarging this one. So... Okay, this one... Hey, we're not going there. Fuck it, get out. Okay... Okay, this one's we're not going to the background colour yet. I don't know if we're going to do it at all. <laughs> going all the way with the black. Now we're going to, going with the contrast, so can't use brightness with contrast. Uh, wonder what we're going to do with the hue. Going to warm it up a fair bit. And then we've got to go here, darken it, and the sharpness. I think that's pretty much our setup for this particular piece. Let's see what we go. Let's see what we got. We got here North Shore Living. Okay, it's going to go on the glass. Let's see how... So it's about... It's much shorter than A4 and a little bit narrower than A4. So you can just see the A4 there. So we're just going to centre it on the page, on the copier. So we're just going to centre it as much as we can without getting too pendantic. So we're just going to line it up there as well. So hopefully I'll have it right. And we'll just hit start, and here we go. So yeah, this is a little bit slow as, as far as photocopiers go, but I couldn't afford a, a more top of the range, closer to a top of the range model. Uh, I normally like to buy things that are top of the range or close to it, like this Galaxy S8 Plus phone, because I need high quality video, but basically, yeah, this is an interesting result. I'm wondering if maybe I could get the hair to be... I'm wondering if I should do that. If I should just add red, red background colour. I'll just got to get back in here. It still looks nice, but I think red would actually make it nicer. Now, why is it we're having trouble here? Sometimes that happens. So we're going to make it red. I'm wondering... If we're not going to go fart around, we're just going to add the red. Let's hope the red comes up truly red, even though I haven't done any more image setups. So this is a highly contrasty image that I've cre um, created, so I'm hoping the red will come out bright, not just a wishy-washy pinky red. And it is a bit wishy-washy, but it is kind of uh, wishy-washy. I'm wondering if we could just go... And do some more work on it so I'm just going to go here I'm going to change do a, a real gear change here when we have this so I like my red to be more red instead of a funny dull or you know wishy-washy is the right word so we're going here with that contrast won't work so we're going to lose our contrast we're just going to up the red and what else are we going to do I think I think that's pretty much it. It doesn't always work, I don't think. Some Sometimes they don't... No matter what you do, it still is wishy-washy. And red often appears wishy-washy, especially on dull originals. So let's see if we've actually improved it. So we've made quite a gear change here. So, yeah, that's even better. That's really colourful. Now, we've actually made this better, not just because the red is more fiery, but the colours are just a lot better. That looks a lot more vibrant. And you can see the machines, this is some digital effect, this motley effect. It doesn't show, it's, it's not on the original, so I'll just pull the original off and show you where the, that the motley look. You can't see the mottles on the original. Yes, you can see some skin blemishes, which is good, because you don't want 
people to be photoshopped. But if you look here, the, this this can't be on the actual skin. So I think I think we'll call that quits. But anyway, there you have it.